Hi everyone, today I want to show you how to decorate a simple Easter centerpiece for your table. We're going to decorate our tree. We have this white craft tree from Hobbycraft and each season we decorate it so we might put hearts on it for Valentine's, flowers for the summer and ornaments at Christmas and we're going to decorate it for Easter today. The first thing I'm going to put on our Easter tree is an Easter egg. That's very sweet. This one is just, well, like all of these things actually, we just from a little hobby craft haul we've just done recently, but you can get these kind of bits and bobs everywhere. This is really cute, look. It's just a little egg shell. Maybe you could use a real egg, I'm not sure. Oh. And just put some mini eggs in it, can you see? care if the kids don't grab it and rip at it in their eagerness to get to the chocolate. Next I have some sweet wire um, daisies. They're really cute actually and they just come on a little wire so you can wind them around whatever you're going to do. They'd be great for cards but I'm just going to put them on our tree like so just to make it look a little bit more um, sunny. I have another wooden egg here which I may paint the outside of in a bright yellow at some point but for now I'm just going to fill that with chocolate eggs too because really Easter is all about the chalk isn't it it just is and um, I might try and find a little chip from somewhere and pop that in too and then we'll hang that on it's possibly a little bit heavy for my tree so mm, let's try from the top well, it's a little about really to find out where things balance the best, don't you? But it really does look very pretty. And I suppose it's kind of like a version of the Christmas tree, isn't it? With chocolates hanging on it. I've got a few other things to hang to, which I'll show you. Ceramic rabbit. And I also have a chick and I'm just going to decorate them with some sharpies before hanging them. I'm going to keep them quite simple I think. So I'm going to use some simple sharpies and they pretty much mark anything so that ideal for this kind of stuff if I can get the lid off <laughs> and then my bunny will be ready to hang. So I'm going to give him a little a little eye. He's very cute isn't he and I'm using pastel colours. I like pastel um, sharpies. I don't know why I've got a bit of a thing for them. And super, super cute for spring, of course. So, yeah, let's give them a little spotty bow tie, I think. Yeah, and maybe some buttons. I'll show you when you There he is, all done, ready to hang on the tree. And I will do the same with the chick. And of course, what's nice about these things is they can be used year in, year out, and obviously your children can very easily do this themselves. Isn't it cute? <laughs> so this is our finished Easter tree. As you can see, it's got lots of lovely homemade bits and bobs on, and lots of chocolate for the kids to pinch off it. Lovely. Happy Easter crafting, everybody.